dear friends in this video let us understand the gst revenue sharing ratios between a central government and a state government on local transaction as well as the non local transaction local transaction called as intra state transactions and the non local transaction called as inter state transaction now let us discuss about the intra state transaction that means the supply within the state the goods are moving within the state right so on the local supply whatever taxes collected on the local supply whatever taxes collected the sharing ratio between a state and the central is 50 and 50 percentages on the supply whatever taxes collected the 50 percent tax revenue goes to central government and the 50 percent tax revenue goes to state government on the supply taxes will be levied and collected in the name of cgst levied and collected by central and sgst levied and collected by state whatever sgst collected on the transaction whatever sgst collected on the transaction the revenue will be kept it only with the respect to state if the goods are moving within telangana the revenue the sgst revenue will be given to the telangana government if the goods are moving within karnataka the revenue will be kept with the karnataka government if the goods are moving within haryana the revenue will be kept with the haryana government and now let us understand one more thing to be about oh and here you need to remember one thing whatever sgst collected whatever sgst collected that will be kept with the respect to state government but on the same transaction whatever cgst is collected on that cgst taxes again some proportionate percentage of that revenue is going to distribute with the states uh, states as well are you understanding initially on the transaction cgst and sgst collected and uh, there is a ratio sharing ratio between central and state is 50 percentage and 50 percentage on this 50 percent revenue the complete 50 percent goes to the respect to state again on the same transaction whatever cgst is collected again in this cgst again the central is going to distribute the revenue to the center and the states as well right as per a gst council or finance commission recommendations now let us take an, an example that how actually happened for example the supply is happening in the state of uh, karnataka even for example i was located in karnataka even my customer also located in same karnataka so i'm just supplying goods to my uh, customers who is who is located in same karnataka that means within the state it's called as intra state transaction assume that the total the supply value is around uh, 10000 and assume that again on the supply 5% is a gst that means a 500 rupees are understanding so the the supply value is 10000 and the gst percentage is 5 that means total 500 rupees out of these 500 rupees the first 250 rupees is, is out of these 400 that means 2.5 for central and 2.5 for state that means 250 rupees is given to the center cgst 250 and 250 rupees is given to a state in the name of sgst first whatever sgst is collected whatever sgst collected will be kept only with the states of karnataka and whatever 250 whatever 250 uh, share has taken uh, by the cgst out of this 250 again some of the revenue is being shared with the center as well as the states this complete 250 rupees sgst goes to the respective state of karnataka and out of this uh, C, uh, cgst uh, 250 some of the percentages is going to distribute with the states as well yes as per gst council recommendation which is mentioned in article number 270 in the cgst act now let us understand the inter state transaction that means the when the supply is happening other than local state that means for example you located in some x state and you are selling goods to y state is called as inter state transaction supply between a uh, two states so on this inter state transaction igst will be levied and collected by the center 
on interstate transaction igst integrated goods and services tax levied and collected by the central government initially yes again on this igst on this igst again the center is going to distribute the taxes between the states as well as uh, a center again are you understanding ah, but here the states is okay but but which state which state is going to be benefited in this igst right so i uh, once again i repeat on the interstate transactions igst is initially levied and collected by the uh, central government on that igst again the center is going to distribute the uh, uh, revenue with the states as well but i am asking you i am asking the question that which state is going to be benefited here for let us now understand the same with an example for example the goods are moving from karnataka to haryana understanding right the goods are moving from karnataka to haryana so what happened here haryana customer will pay the taxes to the haryana customer will pay the taxes to the uh, karnataka vendor so the karnataka vendor in his book of account he is going to maintain the book of account he is going to pay taxes whatever is in, in his point of view whatever liable or whatever is refundable he is going to take care of his own book of account but the center is going to distribute the taxes to the haryana government as you know that gst is a consumption based tax that where the final customer is situated will get benefited now here the customer is situated in haryana so the center is going to distribute the revenue of igst with the state of haryana for example again if the goods are moving from haryana to andhra pradesh again the same igst is going to transfer uh, the center will transfer this value to the andhra pradesh customer if the goods are again moving from andhra pradesh to tamil nadu again the center is going to transfer the taxes with the uh, uh, tamil nadu right so very simple as you know the gst is a consumption based tax and where the final customer is situated will get benefited and to, for more information please find my uh, video attachment so i'm just attaching the article number 270 the cgs act so where all the uh, tax revenue share, uh, shares are being uh, described in the act so please just download the uh, resource from the video thank you